I want to introduce you to someone. This is Jonathan. He was born opioid dependent, essentially addicted to drugs at birth because his mother used drugs while pregnant with him. His mother was also incarcerated, so he didn't have a stable home to grow up in until he was adopted by an amazing woman. She and her grandparents raised Jonathan, doing their best to shower him with love and create opportunities for him to live his best life, but Jonathan just didn't know how to get there. He struggled, and this was just one of his arrest photos. Here's another one. And by this age, most people would have given up hope, but his adopted mother still believed. She still believed that he would one day live a good life, and she hoped that one day Jonathan could believe the same. And about three years ago, he was released after years of incarceration. And the question was, what would he do? How would he live his life, especially now that his adopted mother had been diagnosed with cancer? Lots of people doubted and believed that Jonathan would just go back to the life he had known, that he would never amount to anything. But after getting his GED, Jonathan enrolled in community college, where he earned nearly a 4.0 and won numerous awards. He did all this while working a full-time job, dealing with probation requirements, and first caring for and then eventually losing his mother. But he had promised her and her family that he was going to continue his education, so he did. On top of everything else, he was volunteering with nonprofit groups and sharing a story and applying to colleges. And this fall, he'll be walking the halls of Columbia University. And if no one had believed in him, this may have been the end of Jonathan's story. But because someone did, this is just the beginning of it.